Hi, I'm Skyler. I want to give you a quick demonstration of how to connect to a calendar on someone else's server using your iPad. So slide to unlock, and I've already got a URL picked out. So let's say you were looking for a holiday calendar or something like that. Just Google it. You'll find a URL that looks something like this. You know, a web address. Sometimes it'll start with webcal, and at the end it'll say blah 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 dot ICS. That's a format that calendars on your iPad can understand. So I'm just going to rest my finger on this link in order to copy it. So copy, and then I'm going to go to settings, and under settings, mail, contacts, and calendars, add account. Other, add subscribed calendar. Double tap to paste. Tap next. It verifies with the calendar, asks if I want to use a, a username or password, SSL for security, remove alarms, yada, yada, yada. I don't want to do any of that. I just want it as is. So I tap save. Now we see it listed here. And if I go to my calendars, tap in the upper left, and now I can see all these different calendars. The one I just added was down here, subscribed, Astro. So I'll turn that on, go to the year view, and now I can see all the events that that calendar added. So on the 28th, we see that there's a penumbral lunar eclipse and a full moon both at the same time. <laughs> That's how you add a calendar to your iPad. Thanks for watching. I'm Skyler.